And in our other big story, this man is in the Fairfield County Jail tonight. He's accused of trying to kill his estranged wife and her friend. George Conrad is charged with two counts of attempted murder. His two alleged victims are in critical condition at Grand Medical Center here in Columbus tonight. 99% of people who get point blank shot in the face don't live. The procedure she's having now, he said the maximum lifetime of it is five years. So within five years, she has to have something else done, another bone taken from her leg or something. Just finding people that will do anything to help is, is great. Hi, I'm Jennifer Dodson, and this is my project for Misty, Conrad, and family. I started the efforts a few months back. We had an event called Mad 4 M3, and I involved the local fire department, and we were able to fund money through the fire department. They, they made this a cause for themselves. So if people wanted to make a contribution, they could drop it off at the fire department. And they had already been involved with this family because of the loss of John. John was Misty's oldest brother, and he passed away a year after his wife had died of a brain tumor. I remember having to tell her that Daddy went to heaven to be with Mommy. Here's all his books and stuff, his Bibles, his clocks, and... She's an angel. She, she is. She is our gift on them. Mm -hmm. She brings me happiness every day. She's so loving and kind and thoughtful and honey <coughs> despite everything that she's been through <coughs> how how do i have the right to feel sorry for myself you know this is not george conrad's first trouble with the law involving his wife court records show last year he was charged with stalking harassment and violation of a protection order misty wants to create a nonprofit organization she wants to educate and inform victims of domestic violence. Something needs to be done to where the victim isn't the one that has to change everything. She doesn't really look at the negative, and that's why I think she's like the strongest person I've ever met. She always tells people, she's like, if a bullet can't take me down, you sure as heck can't. <laughs> that's what she always tells people. If I can make a difference, then I would understand why I was saved, what, what my purpose is. I feel I was saved because God has greater things in store for me. I'm not exactly sure what they are yet, but I know good things are in store.